Hello, my name is Kelsey Dykus, and today I will be presenting my STI, which is pubic lice, commonly known as crabs. What is pubic lice? Known as crabs, tiny lice that infest the pubic hair. They move easily from the hair of one person to that of another. Pubic lice are usually found in the genital area on pubic hair although they can be found on other coarse body hair, such as hair on the legs, armpits, mustache, and beard. This is pubic lice, and this is head lice. Transmission. How do you get it sexually? Pubic lice can be transmitted during sexual contact with a person who has crabs moving from the pubic hair of one person to the pubic hair of another, non-sexually. They may fall into underwear, sheets, or towels, where they can survive up to a day and lay eggs that hatch in about a week. Thus, it is possible to get crabs simply by sleeping in an infected person's bed, wearing his or her clothes, or sharing a towel. Information about this STI. To live... Lice must feed on blood. Ew. When pubic lice mate, the male and female grasp adjacent hairs. The female soon begins producing eggs, which she attaches to the hairs at the rate of about three eggs a day for seven to ten days. Information continued. Measuring one sixteenth inch, 1.6 millimeters or less, Pubic lice receive their nickname because their bodies resemble sea crabs. Signs and Symptoms Males, Females People can usually tell when they have pubic lice. There is intense itching, and upon inspection, they discover tiny, pale, crab-like louse or its minuscule, pearly nits attached near the base of the pubic hair. Complications for Non-Treatment Pubic lice infestations can usually be treated with a louse-killing lotion or gel. However, a pubic lice infestation sometimes leads to complications, such as discolored skin, pale blue spots may develop where pubic lice have been feeding continually, secondary infections, if itchy lice bites cause you to scratch yourself raw, these wounds can be infected, Eye irritations. Children who have pubic lice on their eyelashes may develop a type of pink eye, conjunctivitis. How does it affect pregnancy and fertility? Pubic lice does not affect your fertility. Pubic lice can be treated while you are pregnant or breastfeeding, but not all types of of treatment can be used. Your doctor, nurse, or pharmacist will advise you. How is it diagnosed? Pubic lice infestation is diagnosed by finding a crab, louse, or eggs on hair in the pubic region or less commonly elsewhere on the body, eyebrows, eyelashes, beard, mustache, armpit, perineal area, groin, trunk, scalp. Is it treatable? Is it curable? Yes, it is treatable. Yes, it is curable. Treatment. There are both prescriptions and over-the-counter treatments for pubic lice. An infested person does not have to shave his or her pubic hair to get rid of crabs. In addition to killing all the lice and nits on the body, infested individuals must wash all linen and clothing in hot water and dry it in high heat, or the crabs may survive. Treatment continued. If over-the-counter lotions or shampoos, such as NYX, RID, or others, don't kill your pubic lice, your doctor may prescribe stronger treatments, such as melathoin, which is commonly known as ovide. You apply prescription lotion to the affected area and wash it off after 8 to 12 hours. Invermicticine which is stromictosol. 
This medication is taken as a single dose of two pills with an option to take another dose in 10 days if the treatment isn't initially successful. Lindane, because of its toxicity, Lindane is usually prescribed only when other treatments fail. You apply Lindane to the affected area, wash it off after four minutes. It is recommended for it is not recommended for women who are pregnant or breastfeeding or for children younger than age two. Preventable measures to prevent pubic lice infestation. Avoid having sexual contact or sharing bedding or clothing with anyone who has an infestation. If you are being treated for pubic lice, all sexual partners must also be treated. My citations come from the book Human Sexuality, Diversity in Contemporary America, 8th edition, mayoclinic.org, Access Today, 9-24-2014, FPA.org, which is Talking Sense About Sex, accessed 9 2014 and CDC.gov, Center of Disease Control and Pre- Prevention, accessed today, 9-24-2014. The end. Thank you for watching my presentation. I hope you enjoyed it, and have a good rest of the week. Thanks. Bye.